So okay, I, I saw you just wandering around the contest area with a giant antenna and this hooked up and I am lost. What is going on? So, so this is the Ham Radio Village. Uh, they're doing a fox hunt. Uh, they have UHF, VHF frequencies similar to what your TV's had before. Um, UHF is hidden in here. VHF is the whole con. So we have our Yagi antenna. This is a directional antenna. We got your driving element. That's the listening reflector and director. So this will give you a directional antenna, but the first two are real easy with this. You found them, they're, they're, they're there. This last one is running really hot. So having an advanced setup is actually oh, really? a disadvantage. So the because, fox hunt is there is devices. Right, the little devices hidden all, around. Hidden all over the place, all over conference or all over this area? All over this area for UHF, all over the conference for VHF. Wow. Yeah. So you have, can you say it one more time? Because I know nothing about ham. ham. All right. So you have, what is this? Let's start here. So this is a uh, full ham radio. This is like what hams have in their shack. Okay. This is HF, VHF, UHF. It's not, you see a lot of other people out here, they have little portable radios. And those like your handheld walkie talkies. So, um, and then this is just, like I said, a homemade Yagi antenna, 3D printed sections. Chopped up his pipe. Say it one more time. You said you have a transmitter, a receiver. Okay, so th this is a transmitter receiver. That's transmitter receiver. This is a this is the driving element. This is your main antenna. This is a reflector. So when stuff comes along here and flex this, and goes back, and then you have your your guide or your um. Oh, no, I'm sorry. There's a name for it. I'm right. forgetting what it is offhand, but so, so that that, that kind of helps channel it in. So it keeps your direction. Um, and it is you know wavelengths are. Yep, and so wait, and then you're kind of like walking around trying, and then you're engaging, looking at the signal, saying, "Okay, I'm yeah, getting." Yeah, so I'm looking through. at the signal. Most people are just listening to it. Okay. Because they have their handhelds, and um, and then some people, some people have some people have near field antennas, so they're just like sweeping around looking for it like that, not even going by direction. Uh, so there's different ways you can do it, and uh, it's just fun. So, oh, how many have you found so far? I found the first two, but. I'm running out of time. There's other stuff to do as a con. <laughs> okay, so in that case, I won't keep you anymore. Thank you oh, so much. It. What's your handle, by the way? Uh, oh, a handle. Oh, I'm D. Oh, I, thought, I, thought. I thought you were asking for my ham handle. I'm like, come on. I'm not sure if I'm giving that one out. <laughs> so that's a, it's a private thing. Your ham handle. No, it's not private. private. It's very public. And okay. it has all your personal, you know, your address, your phone number. Oh, wow. And okay. it's on a public database. So that's why I'm not wearing my ham tag with my call sign. <laughs> Well, excellent. Thank you so much. Best of luck with the right. fox hunt and hopefully you find it. Thank you so much. Right. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Hack on. I had no idea the thing she held up between us while we were talking. That device in her pocket, that's the fox. That's what he's looking for. Scaf hunt. Unbelievable. <laughs> Thank you.